This is Unit 5, Lesson 10's Lab of Heat of Combustion. So the materials you need are 25 milliliters of water, a burner for methanol, a burner for isopropyl alcohol, the caps for both, a ring clamp, a wire gauze, thermometer, a thermometer clamp, and again, all four of these materials can be obtained from your box. You'll need a ring stand, a 50 milliliter beaker glass, and then another beaker to extinguish your matches. You'll also need matches, a scale, and gloves. So for this lab, we want to test to make sure, test to see how much alcohol is needed to increase the amount of water by 20 degrees Celsius. So to set up, the first thing we want to do is take one alcohol. Both you and the group next to you will be burning the alcohols at the same time. So while one group is burning methanol, the other group can burn isopropyl alcohol. To start off, we'll burn methanol. So the first thing you need to do is go ahead and take the, math, the mass of your burner, the alcohol, and the wick, and record that in the measured data table under the initial mass of burner in grams. You can go ahead and place your burner on your ring stand and then place your ring clamp a few centimeters above your burner. Make sure the burner is centered under, under the ring stand. Place the wire gauze on top. Then place your 25 milliliters of alcohol, or excuse me, of your water inside of your 50 milliliter beaker. Then place your thermometer clamp above your beaker, maybe a few centimeters probably about five centimeters above, and place your thermometer there. Don't forget, since we are working um, in a science classroom, we want to make sure we're in Celsius. So, to do this, you want to make sure you take your initial temperature of your water. So, in this case, it's 22.5 degrees Celsius. Record this in your measured data table. The goal is to increase the water by 20 degrees Celsius. So, since we started with 22.5 degrees Celsius, our goal is 42.5 degrees Celsius. We'll light the match and light the burner. And go ahead and make sure your match goes inside of your beaker of water to extinguish. So again, the goal is to increase the water by 20 degrees Celsius. So our goal for this one is 42.5 degrees Celsius. Continue to stir the, th or stir the water using the thermometer, and you can let this sit for about a few minutes. Just make sure you keep an eye on it. As we approach our goal of 42.5 degrees Celsius, we want to make sure we stir the water a little bit more. And this will go fairly quickly, so make sure you are keeping an eye on it. All right, so we're now at 42.5 degrees Celsius. I'm going to extinguish my flame by placing the metal cap right on top. Now that the flame is extinguished, I can remove that metal cap. And this one might be a little warm, so please be careful. Now I'm going to take the mass of my methanol with the wick after burning and record that in my measured data table. You'll repeat the entire process again, this time using the other alcohol. So in this case, the isopropyl alcohol. You'll switch with your group mates, and they'll burn the other alcohol at this time. Again, make sure that you use a fresh water for this as well. Keep the ring stand and the thermometer at the same location above the burner so that way you can have consistency between the two alcohols.